In broad daylight, two men robbed a store. During the scuffle, the cashier was killed on the spot. A cop who had just gotten off duty was shopping in the store. Despite being a sergeant, he did nothing, simply watching as the robbers left. The police commissioner was furious when he heard the news. To handle such off-duty emergencies, the NYPD had issued off-duty guns to every officer. But this sergeant named Reed did nothing, especially considering he had been decorated twice for meritorious duty. So how could you stand down on the scene of an armed robbery? However, Reed was also in a difficult position. He was shopping with his 10-year-old daughter. The robbers were agitated, he thought about intervening. But with his daughter behind him, he hesitated. In the end, he chose to protect his daughter's safety. So for lack of a perfect scenario, you let a shopkeeper take a bullet. Let him? No, sir, I didn't let him. Reed said there was no way he could have saved the cashier. Couldn't or wouldn't. Our officers are paid to run toward danger, not turn away from it. Yet despite this, Reed still didn't think he was wrong. Given the chance to do it again, he would still choose to protect his daughter. The angry commissioner immediately decided to temporarily reassign Reed to a desk job. Whether he would be demoted or fired would depend on the investigation results. To the commissioner, Reed was nothing but a coward. Soon the commissioner received news that Reed had been hospitalized with a gunshot wound. It turned out Reed had encountered a shooting incident on his way home. Many civilians were in danger. You're a modified assignment. You were unarmed. As more and more civilians fell, Reed couldn't just stand by and watch. He had to charge forward. Unarmed. He was already labeled a coward by 8 million people. He needed to do something to prove himself. These words left the commissioner speechless. He silently left the hospital room, only to be confronted by Reed's daughter outside. She asked the commissioner if he really thought her father was a coward. Just to let you know, my dad's really brave and a good man. If a cop can't even protect his own family, how can he protect others? 